Hey, what's up, everybody? Dunsparce for the win here again. Um, today, we're just going down here after Bell destroyed our room, and then Bell and Sharon are two of my mom, like, saying, Oh, I'm so sorry we messed up G's room. Can you fix it? <laughs> um, but, yeah, then they're like, Oh, yeah, you go fix it. We're going to go to say thank you to Professor Aragi because we've never met her before in our lives and we need to thank her for the Pokemon and then mom's oh, coming over here like oh your very first Pokemon battle it's so great let me heal up your Pokemon um how is that healing your Pokemon I just heard I just heard a little noise and the screen went black um what did you do to my Pokemon mom what did you do Mom, what did you do? Now I'm scared. But anyways, she gave us a watch, so it's all cool. <laughs> so, we saw Belle walk down here, but we're supposed to go meet Professor Aragi, so let's go find her. Oh, there she is. No, 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 and no! But I, I got a Pokemon, and I'll be a great trainer. Watch, I can totally go on an adventure. Oh no, gee! Ah, gee, it's all right. Like, really? Bro, I'll be waiting in front of the Pokemon lab. Um, okay. What just happened? So, what just happened? Bell's dad. How can this be? How could our daughter go on an adventure with Pokemon when she's so helplessly naive? Well... I don't know, sir. I had to, you should put your foot down. I mean, she is very naive. You, uh, <laughs> you must put your foot down, sir. But now, uh, uh, Karen and Bella are like, well, time to meet the professor and <laughs> just go inside without me. Yeah, you're nice. But this is Professor Oragi. And you'll notice something different about Professor Aragi than different than the other professors. She's a girl! <laughs> but now, now she's like, oh, do you want to nickname your Pokemon? And I'm like, yeah, I think I will. So, I'm going to move the thing over here, and here's Mijumaru! Alright, what should we nickname Mijumaru? Um... Now... I gotta think of a theme for this game. Let's see... Well, I've been recently playing this game a lot, so if you get what this this reference is going to be to, then great for you. I'm nicknaming Mijumaru Boon. I see, I see. So the nickname Boon is okay? Yes. Boon, huh? Talk about a great name. Now then, the reason I gave you a Pokemon. Oh, sorry guys. Forgot to move the screen up. There we go. For the Pokedex, right? Um. Pokedex? Yeah, sorry I didn't move the screen up, but. I wish I could have edited that, but I don't know how I could. But that's the other thing I think of in this game. Why have we never met this, this professor before? We've lived in this town all our lives, and we've never met her before. How have we never met her? Well, if the professor asked us, I guess it's okay to go adventuring? And it'll be okay to search for what to do with our lives along the way, right? Yeah, as, as we go along completing our Pokedex, we can wander however we see fit! Um... Yes, Charon. That, because that is the purpose of Pokemon. To wander the world. Whoa, wait up, G! 
And they just run into me. Yeah, that's nice. There you are. So how did things go with the professor? Da 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 da. She asked you to complete the Pokedex? Oh, wow! Well, um, actually, being your mother, I already knew about that. What? Why? How did you know about that? First you rape my Pokemon, and then you... And then you give me a town map food. No! No! Mom? Never talk to me again. Okay? You... You cross the line, Mom. I'm sorry. You crossed the line. You did. You crossed the line. Now, leave me alone. I don't want to talk with you anymore. I don't want to talk with you anymore. Thank you, Mom! Okay- No! Jared, stop talking! God damn it, why is there so much talk? Yay! They're leaving, they're leaving. Good, they're leaving now. Okay, now, let's- Oh god, no, they're still- They're right over there, god damn it! Why? Oh great, now Belle's excited. Gee, over here! Belle thought that we- If we were going to start a journey, we had to all start it with the same first step. Hey, gee, we're all gonna step onto Route 1 together! Okay, here goes! Where's the hoe? Come on! What the hell happened to hoe? Oh, wait, that's... We, we didn't need to say hoe, because Belle's standing right next to me. <laughs> no. But anyways, this is like the basic beginning of the game thing. This is actually called a Minazumi. It's it's basically the new Rattata of the area. And they're pretty easy to, to take down. They've got a lot of attack, but that's about it. As most of the Skordo rodents do. So. But they go down pretty easily. Just like Rattata and Raticate and all of them. But... Yeah, this is Professor Araragi just showing us how to catch Pokemon, and we're gonna catch the Minazumi, or Minezumi, whatever you want to call it. I call it Minazumi, but yeah. Um, there we go, and Professor Araragi's like, so, did you see that? I'll go over the main points. First, weaken the Pokemon. It's tricky trying to catch a healthy Pokemon. If possible, you can also use moves to paralyze a Pokemon you want to catch, or put it to sleep! Now then, a Pokeball present for you all! Which I actually found out the other day. In Generation 1, Red, Blue, and Yellow, they didn't actually give you Pokeballs in the beginning of the game. They actually don't. You actually have to buy Pokeballs after you start the game. I thought that was interesting. They started in Gold, Silver, and Crystal where they actually give them to you. But now these guys are just talking about let's go catch a bunch of Pokemon and be like, oh yay, Pokemon, yay! Oh, and here's our first wild encounter with a Pokemon. And it is a wild Minazumi. Awesome. And we're just gonna be tackling it. This is the whole battle style of the new game. Well, I already went over this with you guys. The battle style and everything. But, like I said, these things go down pretty easily. Just, like, tackle it a bunch of times. And that's all I really can do. Oh, jeez, really? That was... That was... Fast. <laughs> but, yeah. Um... Come on, Boone! You can, you can take this thing out. Um, ooh, that was a crit, really? Oh well, it is level four, also. But yep, just tackling a bunch of Minazumis. And Boone is level seven now. Awesome. And he learned Water Gun. Awesome. Now we're just walking up here. Let's see what this young person has to say. Are your Pokemon adequately healthy? It's not good if your Pokemon runs low on health on the road. So I'll give you this. Keep this 
one in your bag's medicine pocket. And she'll give you a potion. Eh. Just like every game, they start off, they give you a potion or an orange berry or something. I don't know. But yeah. Right now, it's actually winter time in, in the game. And Belle's up here, and she's like, Well, G, should we compare who has more Pokemon? And sure, why not? Say, what? Still just your Mijumaru? Seriously, you gotta catch some others. Think, won't Mijumaru be lonely? By the way, if you check the Pokedex, it'll tell you how many Pokemon you've seen and caught so far. Well, the Karakusa Town, the Professor's Waiting, and the Livecaster starts ringing in. That's the watch that we got. <laughs> Hi there, everybody doing good? Looks like you're starting to get along with more Pokemon. Oh, Professor. I'm, I'm at the Karakusa Town Pokemon Center. I've got some guidance to give you all, so hurry over here. Understood. The Pokemon Center it is. Okie doke. Okie doke? Don't you mean dokey? Uh, whatever. <laughs> See you later. Meaning we just need to go a little further ahead. And they just walk away without me again. What the hell? Why do you guys always walk away from me? That, that's cool. Alright, and here's Professor Araragi waiting in front of the Pokemon Center. Hmm, hi, G! To walk down all roads with a Pokemon, that's the joy of a trainer. Meaning, I need to tell you about the most important place for a trainer. So come on in! Yeah, this is the new Pokemon Center. It's pretty interesting, actually. This is a Pokemon Center. Almost soothing, isn't it? Now for my guided tour. And Bell's like... Oh no! Oh, I'm here too! The Pokemon Center is a wonderful place! Why is that? Because you can recover your Pokemon! And it's all free! Yeah, you wonder how the Pokemon Centers make money, don't you? They're like... But basically, she wants me to heal my Pokemon, so I'll just do that. But yeah, how do the Pokemon Centers make money? They heal for free! But yeah, and then she's like, Okie doke! Again. Why don't you ever like to say Okie dokie? But anyways, your Pokemon are feeling great, so next I'll explain the Pokemon Center's PCs! Which I've had multiple problems with in the past. They're basically the same thing, but with these patches and everything, there's been a glitch that you cannot do anything with Pokemon in the PC. You can't withdraw, you can't deposit, you can't move Pokemon. It just comes up with this, like, blue screen thing that says Japanese stuff, and it won't let you go in. It's unfixable in some, in some of these games. But here's the other thing. They put the Pokemon Mart inside the Pokemon Center. I thought that was pretty cool. So, maybe that's how they make their money. But that doesn't explain the other regions. <laughs> Since the Pokemon Center are different there. Hmm, what should I buy? I know potions and Pokeballs are going to be important. But, yeah. Um, I'm going to do that in my spare time. But, right now, I think there's an event over here. Something looks like it's going on the plaza. Hmm, should we check it out? I'm going to do that event next time. Um, so... Next time, we'll pick up right here. All right, see you all later. Mm -hmm.